What's up, Survivalist? Optimum F in here, and thanks for hanging out with me today, and welcome back to Remnants. Back here with another quick guide for you. In today's video, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about Trader Hawk, where he spawns, and what he sells. If you guys have missed any of my other guides, I'll link a playlist up in the top corner. Make sure to go and check it out. All right, so Trader Hawk was introduced a couple patches ago. He is the second trader introduced into the world of Remnants. Now, if you're not familiar what they do, you are going to need currency to trade and buy and sell items from these traders. Now, the metal frags you can find and smelt down. You're also going to need gold nuggets, which you can get out of boulders in the desert. And then you can smelt the nuggets down in the furnace to get the gold ingots. You are going to need a stone mold. And then the newly introduced quartz crystal here, which you're going to need to find quartz. In the north biomes, in the stone boulders, you have a chance to get quartz, and then you're going to smelt these down in the furnace without a mold to get the quartz crystals. Now that we've gone over the currency, let's see what Trader Hawk has to sell today. All right, so you're going to hold E to interact with the trader. You have a buy tab and a sell tab. Now, anything that is in red means out of stock. You cannot sell these items or, or I'm sorry, you cannot buy these items. On the sell tab, you're going to have trade complete. That means you cannot sell these items. So red on buy means you cannot buy. Green on sell, that means you cannot sell. So keep that in mind. Now, every day his inventory is going to change. So you have to follow him around in the north biomes. And I will get into his locations here shortly. Now, there are eight locations, so keep that in mind. Now, there are specific items that you cannot find out in the world. You will have to come to the Trader Hawk here to buy these items. Some of these items, like the kite and the armor here, you cannot find in the world. You do have to buy from him. Uh, fuse box is another one. Wall switch is another one. There are several items that you have to get from the Trader in order to get these items. All right, so we're going to head to another location where Trader Hawk can spawn here to see what else he's selling. Like I said, every day his inventory does change. So let's get to that location and see what he's selling. All right, so now that Trader Hawk has moved here, let's see what he's selling today. Let's hold E to interact. Now, again, green means we cannot sell. Red means we cannot buy. So on the sell tab... Looks like we can buy some PCBs for four quartz crystals each. Um, some bottled water, shooting target, potato seeds. Again, some of these items are specific to Trader Joe and Trader Hawk. Now, the kite and armor again, surveillance cameras, wall switches, uh, fuse boxes are a few not to mention. Um, now, with the introduction of the repair bench, he is selling uh, some of these tools that you're going to need for the bench. So keep that in mind. You can find them out in the world, but he also sells them as well. And then today on buy, he has nothing. So he is out of stock, but uh, that is a new location here. So let's go ahead and get into some of the locations here that you can find Trader Hawk at here in the North Biomes. All right, so let's talk about the eight locations Trader Hawk can spawn at. Now I'm going to break these down into biomes for you guys. Now there are four spots in the Grove Biome that Trader Hawk can spawn at. Here's an image of the spots where he can spawn, which is the factory, the trailer parks, small rad town, and the hangar. Now, the other four locations that he can spawn at is the forest biome. And in the forest biome, you have Hillside Gas Station. You have the small cabin. You have Big Red Town. And you have the intersection leading to Big Red Town, the farm, and Carney Town. All right, that's going to wrap up this quick guide video on Trader Hawk. I hope you guys found this guide informative. Make sure to comment down below if you guys have any questions. Also, feel free to stop by the Remnants Discord server if you guys need any support as well. Link for that is down in the description. But as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to hit that like button. Also, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe for more videos. And I thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you later. Until next time, take it easy.